Hello and welcome back to another Space Engineers Mod Showcase video. In today's video, we're looking at a modded cockpit. Now, if you haven't seen this already on the workshop, this right next to me is called the Standing Utility Commercial Cockpit, which is a bloody fantastic small grid only cockpit where you stand up instead of sitting. So what do we get when we spawn it in is this thing right here. We do have an inventory, much like all the other cockpits, but we don't have any way to, of course, connect oxygen up to. That would be a little bit silly. So it is only really useful on the Earth-like planet, but you can create some great stuff and slap it onto some small industrial vehicles and make them more immersive. So the utility cockpit right here, we get a metal grid to stand on, as well as two little metal bars right there to hold on to for dear life when you're going crashing down the side of a mountain. We've got a decorative gun right there that does nothing, and then as we move around the side, we got ourselves a welder, a grinder, and on the opposite side, a drill. If I was to grab my character and come around, we can access these on the side and put stuff into the cockpit's inventory. Coming around to the opposite side, we can access the exact same inventory. So if I was to come all the way around to here and come up, we've got the little lever that we just rest our hands on. We can't exactly pull it up and down. It's not animated like that and we have a steering wheel with a little knobbly part on there to help you turn your big old vehicles around. For the LCD screens, we get four of them. One has a clock, gravity, hydrogen and power, and artificial horizon by default. And then around here, we got ourselves some space coffee in this little cup, which is very nice. Always have a drink after a hard day's work. And as we come all the way around, let's get a good look at this model. There we are, that's what we get. Not too much on the front, because of course this will be resting up against something like another cargo container or something else. I'll show you a little example of that later on, because I did strap together a funny little design sitting right there. It's a lovely design, great amount of details, but now I'll show you the custom animation. So just hopping onto it, this is what we get. We come and stand on our little metal grid. One hand goes on the lever, the other one goes on the wheel on top of that knobbly part. And we just stand there and act all fancy. If I was just to come into there, press F7, try and turn around, there are no animations on this, we just rest our hands on it, and that is that. So what can we do with this cockpit other than just making a small grid ship, small grid vehicle to transport goods and stuff around? Well, I made something a bit earlier, which is kind of silly. I made a hovering death cockpit, which is this thing right here, featuring Gatling guns, batteries, atmospheric thrusters, a spotlight, some cargo containers, and a couple of reactors. And this is it right here. So it fits perfectly all the way around this modded cockpit. I've got my character over here to bring it around. There we are. And there we are. We now have a hovering death platform where we can shoot our Gatling guns, fly it around, and assert your dominance on these space pirates. It's also very responsive. I am maxing out the power of two batteries and two reactors, but still, it is quite a fun thing to fly around and just shoot up all the enemies like that. So that is one thing you can do with this cockpit and it's quite neat actually, just going from one place to another, double checking everything on your little floating cockpits. But we can always bring in a small grid land vehicle. So what I've got here is a small block land vehicle used for transporting cargo from one place to another. We've got a small control seat sitting at the front there, but we're just going to get rid of that. As well as the solar panel. We don't need no solar panels. We can place one of these at the very back, which is quite nice actually, and then just try and get into the cockpit. It's being a bit fiddly. There we are. And now we can drive it around from the rear. We can even look straight forwards and have an overview on top of the cargo containers, which is very nice. It's a very odd way of doing stuff. Oop, come on, you can do this. But you get the idea. You can now drive vehicles from the back and have a perfect view just above all your stuff, or you could always slap that up high on a much bigger vehicle. And yeah, it just opens up a lot more options when it comes to building stuff. But anyway, that is it for the standing utility commercial cockpit. It's a fantastic little mod for you to download and play around with. It's a great alternative to the industrial cockpit, especially if you're building a small land vehicle on the Earth-like planet. So it'll be in the description below if you do want to download and play around with it yourself. I highly recommend you do. And I'll be back with another showcase video some point soon. Bye bye.